Okay, so hopefully um, you've got your uh, Oryx maps up and installed and looking a bit like this. Now, how do you um, create a track for you to follow when you go for a walk? So let's say, for example, you were in Rishikesh in India and you wanted to go to go for a walk somewhere. So first thing you do is find Rishikesh. So those little buttons there, that's a magnifying glass, which is search. So we'll go for that. Then we'll tap in Rishikesh. There it is. And then I'll go search. So there it is in India. Fine. So then I click on that. Now, uh, on this situation, because I want to, uh, might want to see it again, I might want to make a, a waypoint. WPT is waypoint. I don't need to, but I'm going to do that. So there's my Rishikesh. Um, blah, 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 blah. So this map we're looking at, the blue one, is the world map that comes with, um, uh, with the app. But we need to zoom in a bit, so we need to switch the maps. So we go to there, then we go to there, then we go to the onlines. Then just jump straight down to this on top of for you. Fine. Now when we zoom in, notice those numbers going up. I'll talk about that. It's the tiles. It's like the magnification in a way. So I'm zooming in like that to get to it, or I can press the zoom button like that. And here we are. Oops, so yeah, where I actually was. So the place that I was, I'd heard about is just up here. So uh, the hotel where I was staying is just around there and I know because someone told me that the old uh, yoga retreat where the Beatles went in the 60s is just down here this Baba cave place so let's go for a walk there so I'll go back up to here again to my start point yeah so first thing I'm going to do is around about there's my hotel so I'm going to click that little road is to, for creating routes I'll click that then I'll go create now these are these little buttons here. This is for, for making of the route. The X on the end is to cancel the whole thing. The blue tick is to accept the whole thing. And then these, uh, the plus and the minus is adding or removing waypoints along the way. So you don't actually need to create waypoints along the route because uh, the route's all safe, unless it's something interesting, it's not worth it. So untick that. So now uh, we, you see the little target there. So we put that over the first spot there and then click plus that's my first spot and you can see it's gone naught kilometers so we're, we're up and running now so i'm going to go up onto that that yellow road click it again down along here and just keep adding them now to get to that spot that i was looking for and as we go you can see uh the kilometers up there 0.98 now and i know that i do about four kilometers an hour when i'm walking so eight kilometers would be good something like that so we come down, where are we going now? Down to there. And then you go down that road there. So you can see what I'm doing here. You just got a wiggly way along. And down to there. And that's interesting as well. These red ones are public rights of way. That little black one, for example, is a, a track, but it's probably private with a gate on the end of it. So uh, I think you bear that in mind. So here we go, going on nicely. We've done three kilometers so far. Now, I think I can do jump down that little red bit through here, along here, down to there, and then I'm going to walk back along the river here. To there, to there. To there, and back to there, right. So that's 7.21 uh, kilometers. There's a couple of hours, that looks spot on. So if I, by the way, if I'm a mistake, if I accidentally went too far, I press that uh, minus to, to remove the last jump, bang. So now I'm back to where I was, and then I correct my mistake, and then put it back and correct. Now I'm happy with all of that, so I press the um, blue tick to accept it. Successfully saved. Right, now if you check there, you can see it's the time is 14.55. So um, if I go now, this is the menu for the route. So I go to there, and then I go to Manage. And you can see that this 
well, the two tips, because it doesn't name it, it just puts the date stamp on it. So I can see it's 7.2 kilometers. That's the one I've just done. That's the times, right? So I know it's that one. It's not some previous one I've done somewhere else. So what you do now is you push and hold it, and then edit the properties, and then just immediately name that Rishikesh. Rishikesh. Walk. Bang. And then I get that out of the way. Do that. Oops, I've forgotten how to do this type. What is it that? Yep. And then I save it. Bang. So there you have a walk um, created um, and saved. So I'll show you how to follow that later. And the little sites Google, sites.google.com forward slash site forward slash Oryx Maps tutorial is a little listing of these various tutorials because I keep rearranging the orders and stuff. So if you want to see the full listing, that's where it is. Okay.